Welcome. In this video I'm going to talk about copying and pasting on a Mac without copying the formatting. So I'm on this NPR website and I'm going to copy this text here. So I'm going to hit a Command C to copy. I'll, oops, I want to minimize that. <laughs> okay, and then I'll go into Pages and I'll paste this. Okay, so when it pasted here, it pasted the formatting. Well, the formatting is not perfect for what the web page has, but it pasted some formatting. But say I don't want to do that. Say I'm like quoting an, you know, part of the article or something. So I'll hit Control Z or Command Z, and to paste without pasting the formatting. Although this screwed up the formatting, this is big type. Now let me get a new document open here. Okay, so this is the article. Okay, and now I just want to paste uh, the text there without all the formatting. So what I can do is I can hold down Command, Option, Shift, and then V, and it will paste in that uh, text without formatting it. So that's one way to do it, is to hold all those keys down. So you have Command, Shift, Option, V. Normally you do Command, V, you just add in Option and Shift. So I still have the formatted version on my clipboard here. Another thing you can do is open up something like TextEdit. Now if I paste this into TextEdit, you'll see formatting here, okay? But if you go up here before you paste and go to Format and Make Plain Text, if we paste it in now, it will be regular text. And then we can do Command A to select all of it and Command C to copy it. And now if we paste it in here, we'll have unformatted text. So you can use text edit as a kind of go-between as long as you make sure you're not on the rich text mode. So you have rich text mode and you have plain text mode. So if you're in plain text mode, this will work. So there's another option you can use. Let's go back to the website and I'll copy this again with the formatting. And there's a technique you can use the terminal with. And if we open up the terminal, I'll type pb paste. So that says take what's ever on the clipboard and paste it to the terminal. Then we'll use the pipe, and that's above the right shift button, up uh, two spaces above, above enter. So shift pipe, and then pb copy. So what we're doing is we're pasting and then sending that output to the copy command. So we're pasting and then copying it again. And if we hit that, if we go into our document and hit paste, it'll be unformatted. So if you have trouble with like the key commands and you are copying a lot of formatted things and you want to do it quickly, you can open up a terminal and run that command there. And then when you want to run it again, let me pull up another website. Okay, my internet is down for some reason. That's a weird coincidence. Let's see if I can find some text down here. So here's some other text. So I can copy this here. Go to my terminal. I can press the up arrow. And when you press up arrow, it'll, run, it'll go to the last command. So I'll press up arrow and hit enter. And then I can go back. Let me make this screen a little smaller here. I can go back to my pages document, I can paste in here, and go back to my web page, I'll copy, go to my terminal, I'll press up, enter, go back to my document, there we go. So, you know, this would be faster to use the key command, but if you're not good with the key commands, this is another way to do it. So once you set this up in your terminal, you just hit up and enter, and it will do that conver conversion for you very, very quickly. So. So that's a couple different ways to copy and paste you know, on a Mac without copying the formatting. So we had the um, hotkey, which was uh, Command V, and then you add in Option and Shift to that. The other one was to copy it into a plain text document with a text edit. And the final way was to use the terminal and use PB Paste pipe to PB Copy. So those are three ways. Uh, there may be other ways too. If you know of any, you can post them in the comments. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.